I'm going to attempt to do a little show on how I find and map the biologicals. A lot of you know how the FSS scanner works. I happen to know that 4A here has six biologicals. I'm going to land down there and map them up. I'm going to go through all the steps that I follow. Right on my joystick I have a key that I can click that's going to set that as a waypoint. So I don't have to think about it later. Let's get the rest of them mapped up. All bodies found. I've also got a terraformable on out here. I'm not going to let that one bother me too much. If I remember, I'll pick it up when I'm leaving the system. It's worth a bunch of credits. Next, we're going to get into range and do the detailed surface scan. some of the posts I know a lot of the people aren't aware of all that that can give them as far as the data goes and also how to interpret it I'm watching my seconds count down when I get to about seven seconds left on the counter I'm gonna slam the throttle to zero and then back up and adjust it to the forget and do flybys. I'll be looking at something else. Got the Toby eye tracker running here. That's all that hopping around you're seeing. Makes it a lot easier to find the biologicals. There is a relatively inexpensive program on Steam, and I honestly can't remember the name of it, that will track your facial movements using your regular camera. Now when I'm approaching a planet, and I know there's biologicals I intend to do, a surface scan, I like to come up on the day and night edge. That way I can slide onto the sunlit side. Almost always a lot easier to find those biologicals on the sun side. Nice looking planet. Weapons out. I guess it's a moon. You get the idea. Got the human engineered detailed surface scanner. It makes scanning these surfaces real, real easy. Also, you don't need to try and go for the bonus. You can shoot as many out there with this as you want. Surface scan analysis on 4A. Complete commander. Use two the, probes. This is the thing that people weren't aware of that I've seen posts on. Uh, there's a, a key binding and you can s cycle through the different, and I think of them biomes, not as plants. I'm looking at bacterium here. You can see that up the top center of the screen. Pretty much everywhere except on the polar cap we have bacteria, all blue. By clicking this keybind, now I'm looking at the blue where tussock can appear. It's not there specifically, but it can appear in this biome. Lutexa, and you get the idea, Stratum. What I'm going to look for is a spot that has mostly everything I want. Right up there in the sun side, there's a pretty good chunk. Where we're calling out tussock right there. That's where I'm going to head. I'm going to pop out. I'm going to throttle up. I 
I usually come in pretty low. When I come come in full speed, I tend to get burned. I'm just going to start going in and out of combat mode so I can see what that landing area looks like without the highlights on it. Because when the highlights go away, I want to know where to go. And as we're coming in here, you see those different approaching depths body four a. of blue. That's a edge of a biome. I believe the darker blue is going to turn out to be a little hillier. Yeah, you can see it here. The darker blue is hillier, lighter blue is less so. The lighter blue is going to be a lot smoother. You're going to find bacteria in those smoother areas. You're going to find the tussocks on the edges. The two... Everything kind of has a biome that it prefers. If you've done it too many times like I have, you kind of get a feel for what you're looking for. When I'm coming down to land, I like to land as close to a dividing line of two biomes as I can get. Gives me a better opportunity to find more biologicals. Kind of a nice uh, skyline there. Atmosphere. It's kind of neat. Exiting Super Cruise. Arrived at Planet 4. A. I often get uh, antsy at this point and boost into the ground. It's kind of hard. I'm going to uh, pop the shields up a little higher. Switching over the dual stick. Super Cruise Gliding Complete Commander. FSD point, ready. I'm going to get down on the ground. Here comes that boost. Mass lock. FSD not available. Start back up. There's some good drop over there. Now what I'm going to do is get right down here in the ground. And throttle down almost nothing. As a lot of you know... Graphics tend to pop in out of nowhere here. It's really dangerous. Particularly, uh, I'm playing it on these. So there's some tech tech right here. Texa, I think it's called. Some more. There's a bunch of piles of it. You see how it just showed up. I mean, you got to be low. And you got to be slow. There's a big chunk of bacteria right there. This would not be a bad spot to land. you get the idea. I'm going to get down on the ground and I'm going to just put along until I find a, something I'm interested in. Or more than one. You know, a handful of different biologicals in one area. Gear down. Touchdown. At latitude 18.09, longitude minus 33.7. Well done, Commander. Launch surface recon vehicle with starter loadout. Yeah, we're just going to go right over here to this. 
Can it up. I'm going to show you a couple of the tricks I used to find the next batch. These are all over the place, so it's not going to be much to see there. Disembarked from SRV to Planet Combo KQPD 5-1314A. Tool genetic sampler deployed. Log stratum paleas, genus nothing stratum. New, nothing new there. Welcome aboard commander, boarding SRV. Stowed tool. Hey, Lance. Just buckle. Left ship. We spent a lot of time flying. It's just easier to get around. Warning. Low fuel situation. And normally I would let it go a little lower. We might as well synthesize that fuel here too. SRV refuel. Synthesis of fuel basic performed. And we're probably too close to actually scan this. We haven't gone very far. Disembarked there. from SRV to Planet so Combo KQPD 5-1314A. Yeah, too close. Tool genetic sampler deployed, Commander. Too close. Boarding SRV. Stowed tool. Out, was, well, I'm out doing this. Oh, yeah. I'm kind of thinking about where other stuff is. A couple other things you can do. Sometimes the night vision makes these things stand up. These happen to be that way. See how bright they get on the horizon out there. Once again, there's so many of them really don't need that trick. But it works. trick I'm going to use and I might as well just turn it on. Don't need it for this but I'm going to put in the camera mode and I'm going to go straight up right in front of me some bacteria then I'm going to spin around in circles there's some more bacteria more bacteria and the fruit texas are all over the place this is w one of the easiest ways to find that. Some of the, l I don't know, less plentiful biologicals. I'm also going to... If I don't want to use the camera screen, I'll get good and high. And look around with that Toby Eye Tracker. That works quite well, too. So there you have it. That's really all there is to it. Disembarked from SRV to Planet Combo KQPD 5-1314A. Uh, Genetic sampler selected. Picking up raw materials along the way while we're out here doing this. Sample stratum paleas, okay. genus stratum.